okay now the last of the ray diagrams for concave mirror that is the object is between f and p that is focus and the pole of the mirror okay so the first thing that we are doing is we are drawing the principal axis okay then the next thing that we are doing is we will draw the mirror okay now you have to draw the mirror slightly on the left side or in the center the reason for that is here the image that we are going to get is going to be behind the mirror okay so I'm just drawing nearly in the center this is the concave mirror drawn with the help of a protractor you will keep the 90 degrees line on the principal axis and three lines up and three lines down you are going to draw this curve with the help of a protractor now from this point that is the pole of the mirror okay you will mark three centimeters which is going to be your focus and six centimeters which is going to be your center of curvature okay now we are supposed to place the object between focus and the pole of the mirror now again the same care has to be taken that here the object is not placed very close to F okay if you keep the object very close to F again the image will go out of the page okay which is going to be somewhere in the middle like this okay so this is the object that we have kept now we are going to draw the rays the first ray that is drawn is from the topmost point of the object okay this is parallel to the principal axis any ray that is parallel to the principal axis has to pass through the focus so this will get reflected back by the path from this point it will go back like this and it will be passing through the focus okay now the next ray that we are going to draw okay is going to be from the topmost point of the object through the center of curvature okay now any ray that is passing through the center of curvature it will get reflected back by the same path okay I will have to extend this more and this ray will be extended backwards okay so it's going to go from the focus it will meet somewhere over here okay now where this ray that is gray colored ray and the blue ray that we have drawn through the center of curvature where both of these rays meet that is going to be the position of your image okay so this is the position of your image this will be your image all right we'll just draw all of these rays now this is your object that's a dash b dash uh, a b okay the first ray that i have drawn is the gray colored ray that is parallel to the principal axis that is passing through the focus the second ray that is drawn is passing through the center of curvature it will get reflected back by the same path now this is produced backwards behind the mirror so we are getting the position of the image as a dash b dash now you can put the characteristics of the image the image is virtual and erect that's the nature of the image its position is it is behind the mirror and size as you can see okay it is bigger than the object so the image is magnified 